in hi guys welcome back to another video in my previous videos we have already completed making analog racing pedal force feedback steering wheel and also the paddle shifters so if you have not come across these videos i'll provide the complete playlist link in the description box please check out from there so in order to put all of this together on a single unit in this video we'll be making a gaming rig setup in a simple way with less budget there are many ways which you can build your rig even with metal or aluminum but considering the budget and the availability of materials in my place i have chosen the wood i have already gathered some lightweight wooden blocks of thickness 1.4 inches along with 8 mm nut and bolts so let's start with the build there is no particular design with specific dimensions for this project it all depends upon your steering wheel pedal and seat design along with your height so this video you can just consider as a reference to get the basic idea and extend it in your own way starting with the base i have taken two wooden pieces of length 54 inches for the sides and two more pieces of length 20 inches for front and back As of now I'll be using this one but in the coming days I'll be upgrading it with a actual car seat I'm making use of some wooden pieces to mount the chair on the base Moving further, I'm using two blocks of length 27 inches, which will be a support for the steering base. This is a flat wooden board of dimensions 20 cross 7 inches. which will be mounted using both of these supports so finally our steering wheel unit will be placed on this surface using two more blocks of length 33 inches as an additional support for the steering base we are almost done with the rig frame now it's time to mount the pedals and the steering wheel starting with the pedals if you have already seen our videos you might have come across this analog racing pedals so this is in a normal fashion 
but for realistic feel i wanted to make an inverted pedals so instead of making another one i thought i'll install the same in a inverted way using some additional supports so this is how i'll be mounting this And at last, our force feedback wheel sits on this surface. Finally, this is how our budget gaming rig looks. This is not the end. In the coming videos, we'll be also making handbrake, head shifter, button box, and also some dials for speed and RPM. Stay tuned for more interesting videos. And also don't forget to comment below how the rig is looking. <laughs> If you want to give it a try and face any difficulties, let me know in the comment section below. For more such interesting videos, subscribe to our channel and also follow us on Instagram. Thank you for watching. I'll be back in another interesting video.